Hello, everyone. We are the the Lab Capitalism. Our team consists of myself, Ikai, and David. We are from the Lab Singapore. We are participating in the Cold Space Autonomous Driving Challenge under the U19 category. For this presentation, we will be showing you our task, which is the Eco Garden. The Eco Garden is a map that shares similarity with forest from the U12 challenge. It features a white line on a black background on one side and a black line on a white background on the other. However, a key difference lies in the path the car must take to clear all the checkpoints. Unlike its U12 counterpart, the checkpoints here are not arranged in a straight linear sequence. Detours are inevitable. Combined with the presence of multiple sharp turns concentrated in one area, this map demands precise turning control and accurate sensor readings to succeed. To tackle this challenge, our first step was to plan the car's route strategically. Observing the first half of the map, we noticed that the checkpoint was scattered rather than aligned. If we were to follow them in a naive sequence, the car would end up making a large, unnecessary loop before reaching the second half. To optimize efficiency, we analyzed the possible routes and identified the shortest path that still covers the maximum number of checkpoints in a relatively straight line. We found that the two checkpoints near the top are close and almost linear, while the one at the bottom sits separately. To minimize travel time, we decided to approach the bottom checkpoint first, then take a swift U-turn to, to reach the two upper ones. This adjustment prevents the car from taking a long detour around the track. In addition, the middle left section of the map presents another challenge. It's a dense area filled with multiple line intersections and color markers. To prevent the car from misinterpreting sensor data or veering off course, we decided to manually program the turning behavior for that specific section. By predefining the turning sequence upon detecting certain sensor triggers, we ensure that the car follows the correct path consistently. This approach minimizes the chance of sensor confusion and guarantees a smoother, more reliable performance through complex turns. The ADC challenge taught us the importance of both competition and efficiency. This principle is very similar to real-world driving, where tools like Google Maps help users reach their destinations through the shortest or most convenient routes. In the future, when self-driving cars become more common in Singapore, they will need to do the same, finding the fastest and most efficient routes while considering factors like traffic congestion and road accessibility. Effective path planning by artificial intelligence will play a key role in ensuring that self-driving cars provide smooth, safe, and quick journeys even in busy city environments like Singapore. Even in preparing for this situation, AI has been useful. It helped organize our thoughts, structure our explanations, and improve how we present our ideas correctly and confidently. By suggesting better phrasing and logical flow, AI has made it easier for us to communicate complex technical concepts in a way that judges and audience can understand easily.